We're with Mustang men's basketball coach Brad Bigler following tonight's uh, annual late show at the Ari facility. And coach, uh, great to get the basketball season underway. You've had a couple of days of practice, but uh, this kind of uh, always uh, gets the crowd into it and uh, kind of the official start of the season. Yeah, it was a lot of fun tonight just seeing uh, a great student section, a lot of support. Uh, see our guys, wheelchair basketball team, it's a lot of fun for them to, to be able to get out, get out in front of a big crowd, play a little bit. Uh, then the women's basketball uh, put on a great performance tonight. And uh, Brie Hollerman, again, just winning that three-point contest. And uh, I think she beat, uh, what is it, three times in a row or something like that. So, And then uh, our guys uh, put on a good show as well. And then we ended up with... Uh, Lavion West with a five-time champion, dunk champion. Uh, I guess uh, you could say that's a pretty, t pretty tough thing to do. Yeah. So, well, coach, talk about uh, the practice now. We get to the serious side of things. Uh, you've got a good uh, returning group of guys, some uh, newcomers as well. Talk about, uh, you know, obviously the first couple of days of practice, uh, pretty basic things. But uh, what, are, what are you looking to do here in the next week before that first exhibition game? Well, uh, right now, a lot of it's uh, defensive-minded. Uh, just trying to. Uh, put in the system, uh, make sure that everyone's on the same page, getting back to a lot of the fundamentals, and uh, and, and really just trying to get our guys to play at a high level, uh, be very competitive in practice, and, and communicate uh, uh, for every possession. And of course, you've got Waldorf for the first exhibition on the 24th, and, and then a special game, your, your alumni, uh, which is always great to come back and play that one on Saturday, the 27th. Uh, you know, talk about what you're looking for, and, and not only the Waldorf game, but uh, you know that alumni game as well. Andy, well, where's my day? Yeah, next week's, uh, this year is kind of a little bit faster. We're starting everything uh, right away, getting the scrimmage, getting the exhibition games in. Uh, really just looking to come out, uh, get together, get, our, get some game reps in. Uh, put together a good performance. Uh, the one thing I will note, though, is uh, for next week, I wanted to make sure we comment on uh, we are going to put together a donation uh, with the next two games, the exhibition and the Andy Wiersman game for a uh, uh, family here in southwest Minnesota. Uh, Lucas and Lindsay Post and their daughter uh, Maya is going through uh, uh, some adversity right now. And with those two games, we would like our fans to come out and support. And with the... Uh, with the attendance or with the gate, uh, we're going to give a donation back to their family to help them through their uh, their moment of adversity. And it's just something that I think is important. When we get an opportunity to give back to the community, uh, these are two people that I've known for a long time. Uh, Lucas played here back uh, when I played, and uh, he's a high school coach in the area. And Lindsey's been a, also graduated from Southwest. So for us to be able to step up in this opportunity and to help them out, I think that's a big thing. So hopefully we can see a lot of the McCray School District where Lindsay teaches, uh, a lot of the Marshall area and surrounding area just to be there and also to support them. All right, Coach, uh, best of luck here the next couple of weeks with practice and the scrimmage, and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Thank you.